Hey, welcome to this Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts gameplay video. If you love the history of naval warfare when castles of steel ruled the waves, then don't miss a minute of what's coming up. Hey, welcome. It's time to play some Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts again. I am having more fun with this than I know what to do with, and I just want to show it off. Now, you can go buy this game if you've enjoyed the videos, or if this is the first one and you watch it and you think it's cool. You can go buy this at the link in the description. I have no affiliation with the publishers i'm doing this because i enjoy it and i'm telling you straight up if you are a naval enthusiast go get this and mess with it support these developers because this is just awesome so what do you say we jump right in there today we're going to do torpedo the dreadnought which i've played three times lost twice <laughs> it's uh it's it's hard. This this game is difficult. You gotta you gotta get a good design, and then your tactics have to be good. And sometimes I can get one or one of those, and sometimes I can get both of them. But most of the time, I screw the ball up. Our bonuses are uh, more torpedo tubes, or optimizing torpedo propulsion, or balanced tech. I'm all about torpedo propulsion. I want fast torpedoes. So, what do you say we jump in there, and this time we're going to go ahead and build the, the destroyer in video, which is a little unusual. Well, I don't know. I did it in, I don't know, did it in a couple of videos. Didn't do it in one. I want to do it in this one. So, let's do it. And while it's loading up, which it is already done, hey, if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. Ring that bell so you know when I post another video. Like the video is the easiest way to help the channel if you care to help. Share with your friends will also help, and please leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Tell me what you want to see. Tell me, you know, insult me. <laughs> I don't care. So I do this for. I do it for fun. And I enjoy talking with people. Here we go. All right. Choose the destroyer. Uh, we want we want 28 knot destroyers if we can manage it. Steam basic engine. Uh, Let's go here. Let's leave all that alone. Let's reduce the weight, but increase the cost. Actually, it did both. Uh, by taking the best armor, which we've got none of. I'm not real sure how you reduce the weight when you don't have any armor. This may have to do with what she's built from. I don't know. We're going to leave all this alone. We're going to leave ammunition alone. But we want... I think standard, and I don't know what difference. It's lighter, and it costs a little less. I'm not sure it makes any difference, because it doesn't say anything about torpedo here, but we'll go with that particular uh, propellant and uh, powder. Turrets don't matter. We want fast torpedoes. We want the biggest ones we can manage with the best range fire we can get radio we don't care and now we have about 200 tons to play with main tower gotta have one gotta have one let's put it right there main guns they don't matter in this this is we'll put one on there because destroyers ought to have Ought to have a gun. And torpedo launchers. This is where it gets exciting. Uh, wow, I gotta put this way aft to offset. Well. I get her balance, which that's close. All right, so she has two double torpedo launchers. 
Well, if I could just select it. Yep, good. Really good. I probably ought to just be building torpedo boats the way this is coming out. I haven't done that. Oh, torpedo boats. Hit protection doesn't matter. Um, speed. Ooh, they just are tiny, aren't they? 28 knots. We leave all that alone. Uh, fast. I have not built a torpedo boat. 19 inches. Uh, she gets a tower, whether you like it or not. And set it far forward as possible. Well, I say that. How far, if we put it back here, can we get a torpedo launcher? Nope. All right, right now, four weight offset is high. Uh, I just want to move the one I have. Perfectly balanced. Perfectly balanced. Oh, she needs a funnel. Well, it's not perfectly balanced once I do that. Uh, enhanced funnel. Everything's in the way. Get out of here. Enhanced funnel. Okay, this old girl, she needs a gun. Two inch, two inch. Half weight offset is crazy. Uh, how are we doing on engine capacity? 17% engine capacity with that funnel? Standard funnel. Uh, 22.6%. Somehow, I'm having fun. Thirty-three point nine percent engine capacity. How many funnels do you have to put on this sucker to get it to work? with standard funnel. Get out of here, funnels. Thirty-three point nine percent energy efficiency. Wow, that's uh that's pretty sad. But a dual funnel doesn't want to fit, I don't believe. Nope. Okay, we're not doing this right. Oh, yes, we are. It's the standard funnels I can get multiples. And I'm just struggling. As you decrease speed, engine efficiency goes up. That makes sense. That makes sense. Well, well, well. How far aft can we put this thing? There. It doesn't care. It's not going to give me another funnel. Twenty-one percent. Well, it looks like standard funnels are the answer. Eh. 
and and do spoilers that did it 94.9 percent all right half weight offsets 35 percent that's awful Ooh, nicely balanced now. Nicely balanced. Finally figured it out. That's a that's an interesting design issue. Now can we get there we go. Can we get more speed out of her? Yeah, we're reducing engine efficiency, but her top speed is we can get thirty one knots. Engine efficiency sucks, but I'm not sure I care about that right now. And we're building 10 of them. <laughs> I've been playing with destroyers up to now. This should be fascinating. Uh, armor. Oh, apparently you just cannot armor these little girls. Yep, armor's not even there. Um, I don't know if that helps any. Yeah, we can't increase torpedoes. We can have big fat torpedoes and little bitty boats that go fast. Ten of them. I haven't tried controlling ten boats. This should be exciting. What do you say we give it a try? Let's go. All right. And we are off. Uh-oh. Italians versus United States. Pause. All right. We've got... Um, well, this is a bunch to control. A bunch. And we start getting into... Well, the first thing we want to do is save. Oh, looks like you got to do that for every one of them. <laughs> Get them all done. I want you guys to close on this guy and put your fish in the water okay now a head a breast it will take them a while to shake out into line a breast but I wonder how that'll work rather than try to do what I normally do which is uh, try to drive these individually straight toward them. We're going to see how the formation works here. Let's go. She's going going fast. We don't want to close her just yet. Whoa. Well, I don't know. Oh, they're, they're shaking out into a breast formation. That's what they're doing. Okay, we'll just, we'll just watch it happen. This could be a big learning experience for how the formations work in the game. And slow down to full. Here come the guns. Taint no smoke with these little guys. They're either going to make their runs and win or they're going to get shot to hell all right this way guys she looks like she's moving to the west with any luck we'll find out if this is why navies were so scared of torpedo boats Boy, we still haven't identified her. <laughs> I don't believe.
believe this. I've never seen. I haven't controlled this many. Let's, uh. The Sagataro. Sagatario. Yes. She's the archer. That's your target, men's. All right, let's come up to full speed. Which may affect her accuracy now that I think about it. Look over here to the left. Aiming in progress, O maneuver. If I slow down to full. On cruise speed, plus 6.9%. Okay, we'll stay at 26 knots. Now we finally got a good look at her. 410 inches, 13 inches, 12 inches, 13 inches, 11 inches, 3 inches. Are we getting any torpedoes off in the water? Not yet. Oh, she's gotten hammered. Nope, don't see any torpedoes going in yet. Normal. Lordy. Oh! <laughs> Where is the Sagatario? Here we go. Bring it around, guys. Get some fish in the water. Oh, they've already there've been torpedoes flying I hadn't even seen yet. Oh, oh, oh. She's been hurt. Yeah, I'm not sure. Honestly, not at all certain how these guys are. Oh! oh. <laughs> Lord! <laughs> I think we got another hit. Speed up. Rigel's just getting beat down. She's been hurt, but she's not anything like dead. Oh, oh. Oh. Fish! There's fish! Making her sad now. Oh, we're making her sad. She's making us sad. We're losing boats. <laughs> Look at this guy closing in. He can't. He's so close. Oh. 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 <laughs> There's fish in the water, though. There's another one. There's another one. I'm 
is she doing? She has torpedoes. She's just coming around in her turn. Come on now. Put that fish in the water. What is keeping her from firing? I don't know. Oof. There's a missing, there's a, where's, there's a torpedo that missed. Sagittario, then I'm making myself crazy with the camera. Oh, she's in trouble. See, I see another torpedo in the water there. Oh yeah, she's in trouble. Boom. Anybody got torpedoes left? Here comes a guy who has some. He's got them. They're circling her. She's dying. She's dead in the water. Looks like she's almost ready to roll over. I don't see any more torpedoes yet. I hear one. Look at this one. Look where she launched from. All right, we've lost half the boats. But she is toast. The Connecticut is toast. Just absolutely nailed look at this one look at look at that Aldebaran shoom <laughs> and done <laughs> it's ridiculous how much I enjoy this well, that was quick. That's what I we haven't even been here for 24 minutes and we've got her sunk. So, now you know why navies of the age were so scared of torpedo boats and why they were created torpedo de boat destroyers and destroyers to deal with them. Hey, I appreciate you watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Uh, videoing this and playing it and I'll see you again real soon hey thanks for watching if you click on that picture of very young was you'll be subscribed so you'll never miss another video then click on that bell notification button and please share and comment see you again soon